It's absolutely vital that we prepare for a no-deal outcome if we're going to get the deal that we need. I don't think that's where we're going to end up. I think it's a million to one against, but it is vital that we prepare. And I think actually that's, that's agreed amongst everybody uh, standing in this, or the last two people standing in this, uh, in this contest. I believe, as a matter of policy, and when, when it comes to fighting other parties, uh, which I've been doing for a very long time in the name of the Conservative Party, don't give them the oxygen of publicity. Uh, that's, you know, so, and that works. I, didn't, when I, I think when I was fighting... Is that a no, sorry? It's, it's a pretty clear no. Uh, when, I was, when I was fighting... <laughs> when I was... When I, it, absolutely not. Look, when I was, when I was fighting... The second time I think I fought in London, I didn't, I'm not certain that uh, UKIP even stood against me. That what you do is you talk about what you're doing. We should be proud as Conservatives of our agenda. We're going to take this country out of the European Union on October the 31st and fulfil the mandate of the people. That's what we're going to do. Going to do. And in so doing, we will take the wind out of the sails of the, of the two other parties that I've mentioned uh, that have sprouted like puffballs, uh, saprophytically feeding off the decay in, in trust in politics at the moment. That's what we're going to do. And we're going to prick those puffballs, if that's what you do to a puffball. <laughs>